So in this video, I'm going to show you how to test a relay that doesn't have a diagram on it. Like if you look at this Toyota relay here, there's no uh, wiring diagram on the uh, on the back, and it also doesn't have the pin numbers that you would normally see on a lot of relays. But the way we test this is, so what this uh, relay is doing is it's controlling a high amperage circuit with a low amperage circuit. So when you complete the uh, low amperage circuit it closes a little flapper door inside the uh, relay here through a magnetic coil and uh, and then it completes the circuit from the high high uh, amperage circuit so when you look at these Toyota uh, relays if you look at the pins the copper colored pins here are much larger than the uh, than the uh, silver uh, colored pins here so the larger pins are going to be the high amp circuit and the smaller pins are going to be the uh, low amp circuit so the way i tested it was i used my power probe here i got it hooked up to the positive and negative on the battery terminal and basically what i'm going to do is i'm going to apply power and ground to the uh, to the uh, low amp circuit here and complete the circuit and that's that's supposed to close a little flapper door or a little door a magnetic door a switch inside the relay and that completes the circuit to the uh, the high amp side of it so I got my uh, test lead here hooked up to a, uh, a ohm meter on my digital ohm meter here and uh, so I got the the two leads hooked up to the to the high amp side that's the side we're trying to complete and when we complete the circuit it's gonna the reading on your ohm meter will look like that so so I have a, a couple little tenths of uh, resistance in my uh, leads here so when you complete the circuit, that's the type of reading you'll see on so your. As you can see, the circuit is open; it's not connected here. And I have the uh, the two terminals hooked up to the larger pins, the high amp pins on the uh, relay. Now I have the ground connector hooked up to one of the terminals on the uh, on the low amp side of the relay, and that's coming off my um, my power probe. So with the tip of the power probe, I'm going to apply voltage here. And then that will complete the the circuit, and then you'll see on the uh, on the meter here if it's a good relay, you'll see it uh, complete the circuit, and you'll see it. Okay, so you see the circuit is open right now. I got them hooked up to the uh, to the big terminals here. I got the ground hooked onto the terminal. Now I'm going to apply power to the up, and when I apply power. You can see it completed the circuit, the relay closed and it released the switch, relay closes, relay opens. So that's what a good relay looks like. So if this was a bad relay, when you apply power and ground with the power probe, the ohm meter would read affinity like it is right now. So that's how you test a relay that doesn't have the wiring diagram printed on it and also it doesn't have the pin numbers so i will link up in the description of the video a good ohm meter and the power pro i'm brian esser from how to automotive i'd like to thank you guys for watching my video encourage you to subscribe invite you to head over to the howtoautomotive.com website for more valuable videos like this and i'd like to thank you again for watching